Hello, welcome to Lime Wars. Today we've got a three versus three. You can see Alpha Team set up here like that, and then Bravo Team is set up like this. Turn off Fog of War and all commands for a bit. See how long I can last with the chaos of the commands of six players. Uh, I may turn them off eventually. It looks like the top right player, who is Jan, is going for a lot of eco. They've pretty much just done eco, which might be a good start for them being stuck in the corner. Over on this side, we've got Red Player, who's going to pretty much be on the front lines of this fight against, well, the rest of the team. Down here, I can imagine Yellow's going to be going for some Navy units or trying to... Oh no, this is actually connected. I thought it was a separate island. As you can see, it's coming this way. So we're going to have two front lines here and maybe some ocean activity. Did I actually just notice that right? No, this one's actually Bravo Team. I didn't notice that at first. I thought Bravo Team was just in a line like this. But we have one separated on both teams on each side of the map. I do think the uh, setup is better for Alpha Team, as these two could maybe use air units or even Navy to just strike twice against this guy much easier than these two can strike against this guy. But these two could work together to take this guy out, potentially. <clears throat> but we'll see how it goes. We do see a scout coming out from it, well, with an interceptor, which is getting shot at, but won't go down. So, Numpty just got good vision over Nickname. Here's some firing going on already. Got the front line here from Nickname right in the mountains over here against Numpty and... <coughs> Having a defensive line in the mountains with artillery is actually really good because the units are moving even slower over it. But there isn't much anti-air to defend from, but he's got more stuff moving in. We've got some reinforcements for SAM units as well. I think Nunt is going to be able to clear out this encampment here for a bit. A bit faster than the reinforcements are going to get in there, but it will hold him off for a little while. <clears throat> and I think Nickname is pretty much just trying to distract him, allowing Red to progress further, who is Webbo. Up in the north, we do have, I actually haven't heard of this player before, Nova Luva, <coughs> who has managed to get across the ocean there and land, take some territory, he's going to be able to build here if Alpha Team are not careful. Green seems to have taken the ocean and they've stopped, I'm pretty sure there was a navy yard just here, so they've managed to take that out. But they are going to have an engagement very soon on this section here. And Nickname is probably going to be struggling at that point if Red doesn't start distracting Numpty very soon. <clears throat> Nickname has retreated into the mountainous area over here, but we do have some infantry coming in down from this side trying to sneak past those defences. I think Nickname spotted that though, he's got some units moving in over there. Over here we've got Pink, I'm going to call him Nova. Nova is got an energy well here but no other production structures just yet he's going in to try and get that energy well which is being shared with Jan and now we've got two players trying to engage and make sure that Nova doesn't manage to keep this land here and they're all in the forest so all these infantry units are boosted because of the forest bonus for infantry just trying to make sure I don't miss out on anything else going on over here. It looks like Red forgot to bring their SAM units up into the front line, or the SAM was just lacking behind, and the helicopters managed to take out a couple of artillery there. Numpty has noticed the defensive emplacements. He's moving around it and attacking from the side, taking them on one at a time and negating that defensive bonus. It seems like Nickname's actually turned off the defence here for artillery. He's kept the defensive line, but although it still shows it, I'm guessing that's more of a visual glitch from the replay. It sometimes happens. So the artillery have actually moved away so they can engage properly over here. At the same time, Red is attacking through the middle, and Numpty is worried mostly on two fronts. However, also Nickname is worried about two fronts here as well. I think Green has focused mostly on Navy units to try and get in over here doesn't have too much production on the ground. Two factories is about all it is. Over in this section, it looks like Nickname was able to push against Numpty, taking away their um, units that were progressing. 
Nuntis trying to come in from the side to take out those units there as he engages with helicopters in this section. He has seemingly won the engagement on this side and can now either progress or retreat and focus on these units here. Pink is still fully committed to focusing on this section over here by the looks of it. There is not much else going on. He's not supporting down in the south section, but he doesn't really need to. He may have done it already and I missed it. But it looks like Webbo is trying to exploit the fact that he doesn't have much defenses here. He's even sending just a few Sams here to take out these helicopters that are coming in. And maybe even just to scout the area. Anything going on down here? Yeah, it looks like Green's making a push, trying to go around the defenses as well. While the artillery push in and deal with the defense. There's infantry moving through the forest to try and get these barracks from behind. He's even moved the Green Navy units into this section here as well to try and help against Nickname, but Nickname's just moving around those for now. Those Sams seem to have caused a bit of chaos over here. We've got a few units going down from the air. We can see a bit of debris there. Blue's Navy coming into play now. He's bringing them in up and around the top of this island here, managing to take out the town that was there. I don't think it was a city. I'm pretty sure it was just a town. Down in this section, Red's making a push now. It looks like Numpty brought most of his units back. And Numpty's in a bit of trouble now. He's got Red pushing in from the right and Nickname moving in from the south. Over in this section, Nickname had some trouble. But it looks like he's cleared up... Well, not all of it. He's cleared up some of it. But there are still a few units progressing forward towards those barracks. But he should be able to hold them off with what he's already got there. Numpty's probably in the worst situation right now. But we have three airfields here. So Crypto could... Not, that's not Crypto, sorry. Nova could easily just switch down here with the air units that he's got. But he's really focused on trying to get this area to be safe for now. And I am missing the Navy uh, attacks that are going on over here. They're shooting over into the land. Trying to target this structure here. Apparently they can reach it, but it's not going to. Just slightly out of range. Numpty is pushing Nickname in the south, but we'll soon have to deal with the approaching army from the east. I just had to work that out in my head, sorry. <laughs> but Numpty's able to push Nickname back again, so Nickname's struggling a little, but he's able to handle it. don't think he's in any dire trouble right now, but it looks like the Navy units are moving in here. I don't think he's going to see much. Maybe he'll get this factory. It's relatively unprotected. We got some ships over here which are attacking the helicopters and anything that's trying to progress forward. Red's even got some aircraft in the air over here. Trying to take out Nova. I think Nova's pretty much lost that location now. He is still doing as much damage as he can. He took out the airfield just there. And it's mostly his helicopters that are defending the land right now, and they need to get out of there. They're currently just sitting ducks right now. In this center point here, we do have two forces focusing towards Nickname here, but I think he could probably take out Nickname, but at the same time having no reinforcements coming in because of the Reds army here. It's going to struggle to keep that going, and I think Numpty is pretty much just trying to make sure he survives for this point. It shouldn't last too long though. He will be able to push back soon because Nova has decided to send most of his forces down into this section here. He's not taking territory, so he's going to be grabbing or going into this tech direction pretty quickly. Green, on the other hand, has built up a sizable force, more so this time than before, but he still is limited on anti-air, but he is trying to get some out there. I don't think he's worried too much about it, but he's also bringing in some more Navy units. He's going to cut off the reinforcements coming in through this section here, by the looks of it. Nova's coming in through the, south, uh, through the north now. And we'll cut off Red's reinforcements. So Numpty just has to deal with what is left over. Which he's actually struggling with quite a bit at the moment. Which I'm not surprised. He has been teamed up on from two people. And Pink is going to go straight for Red. Rather than coming in to try and help defend. He's letting him deal with it. And he's sending his units in to pressure Red. But he has lost this section here now. So there is less for Red and Blue to deal with. It looks like Green's out of energy. His Navy is trying to get into position, but they're just being slowed down with Black Smoke. 
and Nickname separated his forces. He's got his defence line here, which a helicopter's blocking his path. But he's got a defence line here, and he's sending his infantry up this way. That way they can push through the forest once these units start attacking. And maybe get a bit of an advantage. But I think Green spotted what he's doing. Green's trying to go around this side. Staying a bit further away and able to push in through this section here. Or maybe just simply go around it completely. Nova's forces are doing really well in the centre here. And Webbo is just sending in units at the moment. He could probably retreat and try to build up some more units in this section here. Before sending them in. But I think he's just trying to support via the air. And there actually is not much anti-air here at all. So in fact I don't think there's any specifically anti-air units. So these bombers are going to just get away with some free hits. So other than the helicopters that can shoot them. Over in this section, Green has managed to get some units round, and he is trying to get into this section here, but it's not really working out directly, but he's got more reinforcements coming in this way, which he has now left this defended area exposed, so he might be able to take that out soon. And he's got too many Navy units, he's trying to move them all at once. Might be worth just separating some of those units, or maybe even turning off production if he hasn't already. It looks like he has. And that's one way to manage it. Do have a transport jet coming all the way over here for some reason. Oh, he's coming down this way. They're trying to land at the back of Green's base. That commando drop could do some havoc, or at least a little bit of it. Over in this section, Red and Blue have managed to push their way back through, or at least defend against Nova. Nickname is pushing up against Numpty again, and Numpty is slowly dwindling with time, but he has started building further back. <clears throat> but even there, it's being pressured here. And we also have Blue's Commando sneaking in from the north there, and they've spotted these structures here, so they're going to be able to take that out. That was a fortunate find for Alpha Team. Jan on the ball there. Over in this section, Nova's actually coming in to try and take on some, uh, some energy wells. There is a lot going on in this battle. It's hard to keep up with. Green is actually managing to put pressure against Nickname right now. And I would like to see what happened to the commandos over here. I can hear them. They're trying to take out the industry there. It would have been good if they could take out the energy well. That would have done a lot for them. But there is quite a few power plants there now as well. So these navy units are probably going to be a bit better supplied. Even though it must have cost them quite a bit. Green is winning in the south on this section here, and a few commandos is probably not going to change that in his main base. Not just yet. Nickname is going to struggle there, but he is focused, pretty much sacrificing sections of his own area just to try and keep up some pressure in the north. And Jan has a section up here, which he's now pushing down with, which, although it's not enough force on its own, is giving free way to... Webber, who's able to push up through the south of Nova's base. It seems like everyone is just trying to cling on to survival, and Nova has waved the white flag. It looks like Blue only really had to worry about Green and the waters. He wasn't able to get his navy out, and... That really made it easier for Green to keep hold of the south. And Green is now pushing against Nickname very heavily. And they've finally found that factory in the forest, which has now gone down. It is now currently a 2v3. It's Numpty and Crypto versus the rest. And that sound you can hear now is where Nova left the game. Crypto has given up despite being in a winning position. I think he just decided his team wasn't able to come back from this. Especially if Numpty were to lose on the other side of the map. But yeah, what do you think of that game? I thought that was quite chaotic, so I quite enjoyed it. Um, feel free to click on one of the two videos on the screen right now, and I'll see you there.